So we're here after the Armthorpe game where Hina have just won 2 1 with goals coming in, in the first half from Jay Cooper and Sean Gregory. Glenn, you mentioned a little bit at the weekend about playing the teams towards the bottom of the league. Um, yeah, difficult sides. Um, how do you think we got on? Yeah, they made it difficult, Tony. I thought um, for anyone who read the programme notes, has a look at the website, does the research. They are where they are in the league, we are where we are in the league. And I said we're in a false position, I think I'm thought oh, If you look at the form table, the fifth, we're third. So we're never going to be easy, they're never going to roll over. I think we've played worse and won. I think we've played better and lost. The most important thing is we've got three points, and that's five unbeaten, four wins, a draw away at Workshop. I don't want to criticise because we said at half time we can be better, and I think we came out of second half. Like it has on fire. We had two or three guilt test chances in the first 10, 15 minutes of first half, second half, sorry, to put the game to bed. That didn't happen. At the end of the day, it's never going to be a given. People aren't going to let you score goals and win games. You have to graft. And for the last 10 minutes, backs against walls, gave them a cheap goal. But again, resolute defender where we had to defend. Didn't take our chances, but we got three points, and that's all that matters. Excellent. Steve, um, Glenn's mentioned that we're back to the walls a bit there. How, how do you rate that performance out there tonight? I think it's a difficult game to analyse, Tony. Um, I think at times we played some nice stuff, which Glenn said, you know, 15 minutes, beginning of the second half, we peppered their goal, we've hit the post, Mr. Sitter got a chance to put a cross, uh, a cross and, you know, we haven't done it properly. Ball's come out, we've hit the bar. That uh, keeps made a couple of good saves, so from that perspective it looked good. And then at other times we just haven't kept the ball. We, we are, it's bounced off uh, at the front three, the, the back four. You know, missing the midfield out. I don't think the midfield worked hard enough at times. So it was a very difficult game to analyse because we, we played in patches. But um, at this stage of the season, sometimes you've just got to win games. And it's three points and that's the most important thing. OK, Kenny. Um, both... Both have just said that. Um, back to the walls, obviously. We've managed to get wins against Cleethorpes, um, Staveley, sides that are up and around us in the table. Have Hena Town showed tonight that we can stay focused and we can keep that and get the win against the sides at the bottom that are quite difficult? Well, yeah, we've won 2 1 and we know we can keep compete with anybody in the league, but I must say, Armthorpe are a decent side, they, they try to play football and they've got some very good players and I think like Glenn says they are in a false position but we've, we've won three points and we move on to Saturday against Retford and then Tuesday against Paramore um, Tuesday night but it's about us and we need to carry on and keep winning and see where it takes us really. Brilliant. Glenn, um, back in January, I'm sure your phone had steam coming out of it, the amount of texts after games where we've not got results. Has it gone a little bit quieter over the last few weeks? Yeah, it has to be fair, Tony. I think people have lost my number. Um, that's football, isn't it? People always have the opinion when things are going wrong. I always had faith in what we were doing when we had that shake-up. and Again, it's outsiders looking in and... Unless you're involved in our management team, our squad, our dressing room, you don't know what we're doing, people, even tonight. People presume we're doing things and we're paying this and we're paying that. And they have done all season. I'd start worrying when people don't talk about us. If they're talking about us, then we will have to do something right, aren't we? Excellent. Thanks for your time there, gents. Cheers, Tone! See you in a bit. Have a